Hello friends, welcome back. In this tutorial, we will study about break statement. The break statement is simply written as like this, break followed by semicolon. Break statement is used to terminate a loop and exit from switch. Till now, we have not studied about switch statement. About switch statement, we will study later in a separate tutorial. This break statement can be used within a for loop, while loop, do while loop or switch statement. Now, how this break statement works, it will be more clear when we execute this program. Now let us see this program. See here, here I have declared an integer variable i and after that there is a for statement. Now see what happens, uh, what I am doing with this for statement, by using this for statement, I am printing all the integer numbers from 1 to 5. Now see here, when I execute this program, what happens, all the integer numbers from 1 to 5 will be printed. Here you can see this. Now, let us see how this break statement works. So inside this for loop, right, I have written a one statement if value of this index variable i is 3, then the break statement will be executed, right. Here I have written this if statement and in if statement uh, what I have uh, written, I have written that uh, after if uh, it is followed by parenthesis, if is followed by parenthesis and inside the parenthesis, the condition is the value of variable i is 3. So when this condition is true, the break statement will be executed. And what this break statement does, this break statement will terminate the loop, right? So what happens? Uh, see here in this uh, for loop here uh, in uh, parenthesis you can see these three expressions first expressions uh, what it does it uh, assign the value 1 to variable i so the initial value of variable i is 1 and the condition is i less than or equal to 5 so as long as uh, this condition is true this compound statement should be executed now See this third expression what this expression does at the end of loop this expression increases the value of variable i by one so inside this curly braces you can see that first statement what it does it checks if the value of i is 3 if the value of i is 3 then the break statement will be executed and after the execution of break statement what happens it will terminate the loop control will directly come out of the loop then this statement will not be executed and the loop will terminate right since this statement will not be executed then what happens uh, then the value of variable i will not be printed on output screen right so when the value of variable i is 3 it will not be printed on the output screen and after that what happens uh, after the execution of break statement uh, apart from this this loop will also terminate so due to the termination of loops control will come out of the for loop so what will be the output of this program uh, this uh, program will print only two values one and two on the output screen because when the value of variable i becomes uh, 3 then control will come out of the loop right and since the break statement is before this statement which prints the value of variable i then what happens then uh, uh, this uh, value of variable i will also not be printed on output screen now let us see here So when I executed uh, this program, you can see here only two values are printed on output screen. Now see the difference.
if inside the for loop this statement which prints the value of variable i it is executed before this if statement then what will happen uh, when the value of variable i becomes 3 then first the value of variable i will be printed and after that it is checked whether the value of a uh, variable i is 3 since uh, now the value of a uh, variable i is 3 at this point then the break statement will be executed and control will come out of the for loop so the values 4 and 5 will not be printed on output screen but uh, the value 3 will be printed on output screen because break statement will be executed after the execution of this statement which prints the value of variable i right so when the value of variable i is 3 first it, uh, the value 3 will be printed on output screen and then break statement will be executed after checking this condition now see when i execute this program you can see the output values 1 2 and 3 are printed on output screen so this is how this break statement works